and welcome to the Believer's Voice. I'm your host Violet Peer, and I'm your co-host Renee Durham. Today we're on location at West Holly Springs Church of the Living God, where the proud pastor is Pastor Valetta Shaw. Not only is she the proud pastor of West Holly Springs Church of the Living God, she is the community outreach coordinator for the African American Breast Cancer Outreach Program. And also we have Ms. Doris Perkins, who is the African American Breast Consultant for the Nacogdoches community. Okay, Pastor Shaw, can you please tell our viewers about your organization and give us a little more in-depth information about breast cancer awareness? Thank you, Violet and Renee. Uh, I am Pastor Valetta Shaw. I'm the pastor of West Holly Spring Church of the Living God in Laneville, Texas. And I'm also the community outreach consultant for the African American Breast Cancer Outreach Project. Uh, our project uh, comes from the uh, University of Texas Nursing School at Austin. And we are in connection also with the Memorial Hospital in Lufkin, Texas, uh, through their clinic there to help black women to come in to get their mammogram screenings and cervical screenings. Uh, our project has been funded by the government to educate black women about breast cancer. This project will enable black women uh, 40 years of age to 62 years of age to get mammogram and cervical screening for free if they qualify. Uh, the qualifications are that they have to be 40 to 62 and uninsured. If they are uninsured, then through our project, they can get these screenings that are so needed for black women. Uh, white women get breast cancer more often, but uh, black women die from it more often. So we are in a higher percentile uh, of deaths from breast cancer. We are striving in the community uh, in different aspects. Uh, going into churches for presentations. We do presentations for civic groups uh, and other organizations in order to educate black women about breast cancer. Amen. Also, we have Doris Perkins here who is the outreach consultant for the Nacogdoches area. Doris, you have anything to add? Yes, I would like to say many women will get breast cancer and many women will survive from breast cancer. Woman, a woman's chance for survival are depending on early detection. The best way to detect uh, breast cancer is in early stages is through regular clinical breast examination and screening mammograms. Who gets breast cancer? All women have a chance of developing breast cancer. Mm -hmm. The biggest risk factors are being a woman and aging. Women old, uh, 50 and older, 50 years and older, most likely to develop breast cancer. An estimate of 15,122 women in Texas will be diagnosed with breast cancer this year. Mm. It estimates 2,717 women in Texas will die from breast cancer this year. The mortality rate is higher for African American women with breast cancer than white and Hispanic women with breast cancer. When should a woman get screened? A good breast health routine includes an, an annual clinical breast exam and a regular mammogram. A woman should talk to her health provider about when she should begin and how often she should get regular mammograms. Remember, getting a mammogram only once is not enough. What are some of the things that you are doing to make women aware of breast cancer? Thank you, Renee. Uh, we uh, try to go out into the community and talk to black women wherever they gather. Uh, we go into mission groups at churches, we go into civic groups, uh, even if uh, your special girlfriends on a Friday night get together to play cards, we'll come in and talk to them about breast cancer. It's 
it's important that we get this information out that women will know uh, what is offered for them uh, as far as getting their mammogram and cervical screening. October was Breast Cancer Awareness Month and we put on a very formal tea in Lufkin on the 31st of October there at the Lewis Turan Center on Kirk Drive and uh, it was very very successful. We had uh, ladies that were survivors of cancer to come in and give their stories. Uh, we talked about uh, getting mammograms, getting cervical screenings, and shared with uh, each other about what we could do to bring more awareness in the community to uh, black women about this project. Uh, I would say that if you have mission groups at your church, or if you have a civic group that would allow us to come in and talk about this very dreaded disease and what we can do about it in our community, that we are available. Uh, all you have to do is to contact us. You can contact me, Valletta Shaw, uh, in Lufkin, and my phone number is 936-232-0836, uh, anytime, night or day. You can also email me at evangelist1914 at yahoo.com. And certainly we would like to come to your church or your special group to talk to them about breast cancer. This is so very important to the survival of our women and many of our women uh, have different uh, areas of the treatment that they are afraid of, many myths in our community that we want to bring down and let women know that it's safe to go in and get your mammogram. Uh, we also have board members who will partner with women that are afraid to go in for mammograms, don't have anybody to keep their children, or whatever the situation may be, that they will partner with them to help them to get in and get their screenings. Uh, this is a great program, and uh, we just admonish black women to uh, get in touch with us. Let us tell you about it and uh, get you in so that you don't have to die from this dreaded disease. Amen. Amen. In the Nacogdoches area, during the month of October, which was uh, Breast Cancer Awareness Month, we chose to do the Pink Ribbon Sunday. This was a Sunday that the churches, all the churches in the area could get uh, be a part of this great awareness. When we tried to uh, work with the ladies and work with the um, pastors of that area, we took pink ribbons and uh, provided pink ribbons for each one of the churches and which they pinned the ribbons on and took pictures of each of the churches. And we got a great, uh, tremendous amount of uh, okay. support. support. Uh, we, are, we also uh, chose to use, we used the other areas also like uh, St. Augustine area, Shady Grove area, Garrison, uh, Mine Enterprise, um, Center, uh, some of the other smaller areas around Nacogdoches. And we had a great turnout for Pink Ribbon Sunday. This gave the women a chance to put their name on the list to be screened for uh, breast cancer. Amen. How can they get in touch with you? Uh, you can call me at 560-9441, that's area code 936, or you can email me, natsissy52 at sbcglobal.net.